Virginia Governor Glenn Youngkin remains on the radar for a 2024 presidential run. Now the head of Fox, Rupert Murdoch, is saying he hopes Youngkin will enter the race. It's an interesting political twist. NBC 29's Maggie Glass joins us live in our newsroom with a Virginia perspective on a presidential question. It's our top story at five. Hi, Maggie. UVA Center for Politics makes its living watching this sort of thing. They do not know what Youngkin will ultimately decide, but they do know he has limited time to make up his mind. The finite talent pool, uh, there is a finite monetary pool when it comes to donors. So the later he puts this off, the harder he makes it on himself. J. Miles Coleman is with UVA Center for Politics. He's been watching Governor Yunkin flirt on the edges of a presidential run. He has this really interesting balance between, you know, say, his national ambitions um, and the Republican Party in Virginia. Beyond the will he or won't he, in whatever Rupert Murdoch thinks, is what Virginia thinks. The risk, Coleman says, is the governor looking like he's interested in something other than his job. Basically, voters don't like feeling, they don't like feeling ignored. Youngkin's only political experience is being governor. Coleman says that lack of an elected resume may not be as important as it once was. Ever since Trump in 2016, the Republicans have really loved these outsider businessmen. A question that remains is if Youngkin's popularity in Virginia will translate on a national stage. Obviously, probably got some Democrats to vote for him in, uh, in a governor election. But are they going to be comfortable with having him in more of a higher profile national role? I don't know. If Youngkin is going to run for president, Coleman says Virginians can expect an announcement by the fall. Live in the newsroom, Maggie Glass, NBC 29 News at 5.